，小小咪，我们今天要讲的故事跟黑衣公主有关，你还记得书名是什么吗 ？Princess and the Black Monster Science Fiction Science Fiction 是 rhyming words， 是 rhyming words， 是有押韵的字，没错。我们今天要讲的就是。黑衣公主最新的一集叫做《The Princess in Black and the Science Fair Scare》，她好像去参加一个科展了。她今天要面对的是一个火山怪物，里面怎么会有怪物啊？那个会讲话？他会讲话？对啊，为什么火山会讲话？你有看过吗？没有啊。没有，那怎么会长出怪物？我们来看看这个故事吧。哦，这是木兰花公主。他好认真的在画海报。对 ，Chapter One. Today was the Inter Kingdom Science Fair. Princess Magnolia had never been part of a science fair before. She was excited, also nervous. Feeling excited and nervous at the same time made her want to wiggle. <笑>你也在 wiggle。我最爱的 wiggle 是这样子。你怎么 wiggle？ Wiggle, 对，小心不要打翻你的点心、啊。你会这样子 wiggle 吗？会呀、啊。She grabbed her science fair project, a poster that showed how seeds grow into plants. She did not grab her monster alarm ring. The gold avenger was watching the gold pasture today. He would stop any monsters that attack while she was gone. She was all set for a monster-free day. Princess Magnolia walked to the train station. So today, the Magnolia will be made into a journalist to help her look at the monsters. The Queen is very peaceful. She went on the train to attend the exhibition. The train was crowded. A man squeezed her on one side. A woman squashed her on the other. In the middle, Princess Magnolia held her poster. You see, she got hurt. 挤坏了，好拥挤哦！你还记得我们在台湾做捷运的时候也是这样吗？很挤，对不对？都是人。他他那个海报都快掉下来了。She was excited to share it at the fair, and she was nervous it wouldn't be good enough. But first, she had to keep the poster from getting squashed or squished. Chapter two. The Inter Kingdom Science Fair was crowded. Princess Magnolia worried that she wouldn't fit in. She squeezed between the tables. She scrunched between the people. 到处都是人，大家都来参加科展。你看，帐篷里面都是人呢，而且好多我们之前看过的公主，对不对 ？At last, she found her friends. 你看，我最喜欢的公主。你最喜欢她是不是？嗯，它很可爱，有有那种中国风的感觉，像木兰一样。Hello, Princess Honeysuckle," said Princess Magnolia. "Your mole habitat is amazing." "Thank you," said Princess Honeysuckle. "Moles are my second favorite animal after wolves." "Oh, I like unicorns best," said Princess Magnolia. My second favorite used to be bunnies, but now it's cats. 为什么他现在不喜欢兔子？你还记得那一集吗？有一大堆的兔子，好恐怖哦，什么都吃哎、欸，连树皮都吃，很恐怖。所以大家就不太喜欢兔子了。I like dragons best," said Princess Snapdragon. Also, hedgehogs. Princess Snapdragon was. Pouring hot water into a bottle, when she placed an egg on top of a, the bottle, the egg got sucked right in. Wow, this is 这种一种压力，对不对？她就把它吸进去了，好厉害哦 ！That's amazing, Princess Snapdragon said. Princess、um, Magnolia, I don't know how you got an egg to fit through the opening of that bottle. I used a trick with air pressure," said Princess Snapdragon. 所以是那个压力，大气的压力，它就噗就吸进去了，很厉害。Hello, Princess Sneezeword," said Princess Magnolia. "Your blanket fort is so tall." Wow. 他连科展都是跟那个棉被有关系。他可以把棉被堆那么高，你有办法吗？那都会倒下来，对不对 
Oh, I used a lot of blankets," said Princess Sneezeword. And Twine, I'm amazed it doesn't tip over. Yes, I work hard to distribute the weight evenly. Wow, Princess Orchid," said Princess Magnolia. "Your project looks amazing. It's a seesaw that can lift buckets," said Princess Orchid. I call it the bucket boosting teeter totter. Wow, this is the one that I invented. Oh, can you lift the water bucket up? Right? The top can be put animals, and it will help you lift the water bucket. You can do it with a paddle. It's very easy. It's very easy. There are so many good projects," said Princess Honeysuckle. "I wonder who will win first prize." 大家都很厉害。Princess Magnolia hugged her poster. It felt small and silly next to the mole habitat and the egg in a bottle and the blanket fort and the bucket lifter, and Tommy Wick Towers talking volcano. Wait, what? 他会讲话。Eat. Chapter three. Excuse me, said Princess Magnolia. 我可以用这样子。Eat. 对，很可怕的声音。Excuse me, said Princess Magnolia. Did your volcano just talk? Uh, no, said Tommy Wick Tower. Eat, said the volcano. Oh. I think your volcano just talked," said Princess Magnolia. "No, it didn't," said Tommy Wick Tower. "Eat," said the volcano. Wow, 好可怕！会讲话的火山，真的是活火,火山呢。Oh, but I'm quite certain," said Princess Magnolia. "Hmm, it's not supposed to talk," said Tommy. "It's supposed to erupt." I should have tried it at home first. Did you add baking soda? Asked Princess Honeysuckle. Yes, said Tommy. Did you add vinegar? Asked Princess Snapdragon. Yes, said the volcano. Oh, yes, said the volcano. So it's not Tommy saying it. It's the volcano answering. Oh, scary! I'm still talking. But it still didn't erupt," said Tommy. "So I added some monster fur." Oh, oh! 原来是因为有怪兽的毛啊。Mmm," said the volcano. Or rather, said the goo inside the volcano. 里面居然有黏糊糊、软软、恶心的东西耶。The goo growled and it grew. It Growled and grew, and it was ta-、uh, taking up all the space inside the volcano. 越来越挤，越来越挤的。你看那火山越来越大了，好可怕哦。Hey, get out of my science project," said Tommy. "Now," said the goo. Tommy tried to pull it out. It stuck like the stickiest gum. "Oh dear," said Princess Magnolia. Tommy hasn't made a talking volcano for his science project. Tommy's science project has made a monster. Oh oh! Chapter four. <gasps> It's a monster! Somebody screamed. Oh, I will go get help," said Princess Magnolia. She squeezed through the crowd. She scrunched under a table. You want? She wants to do what? You think? 不知道，他躲到桌子下面去变装啊，对不对？他不能让人家知道他的真实身份。When she came out of the other side, she was no longer Princess Magnolia. She was the princess in black. She made sure her mask was untied. After all, no one knew that prim and perfect Princess Magnolia was secretly the princess in black. I'm here to help," said Prince, the princess in black. "Oh, so am I," said another masked hero. 你还记得他吗 ？Princess in blanket. 对 ，the hero jumped free of the blanket fort. She tripped on a blanket, but she hopped back up again. 对吗？嗯。
Oh, good to see you, princess in black blankets," said the princess in black. "The science fair needs heroes." "Yes, I heard a monster took over Tommy Wick Tower's project," said the princess in blanket. "And hmm, I happen to be nearby." "Get out of my volcano!" Tommy yelled from a safe spot behind a table. Now said the goo monster. It growled. It grew. It growled and grew. 越长越大，越长越大，越长越大。哎，好可怕哦。The volcano can erupt when you are in there," said the princess in black. Also, you are squished," said the princess in blankets. "Find a bigger home." Now said the goo monster. Just then, the pressure from the baking soda and vinegar did erupt. It erupted the monster right out. Everybody screamed, "Ah!" Eat science fair," said the goo monster. "Oh, you may not eat the science fair," said the princess in black. The goo monster tried anyway, but it only ate one thing. Princess Magnolia's poster. Oh oh, <laughs> 本来就很小了，结果最后它被被它吃掉了。That's it," said the princess in black. So the goo monster and the princess in black watch battle. 他们要开始战了。你猜谁会打赢？正义使者会赢吗？还是怪兽会赢 ？Volcano rumble. Ta-da! Bucket bash. Kong, twinkle, twinkle, little smash! Sha! This is my favorite trick. The goo monster did not go back in the volcano. Finally, he got out of 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 Oh, now said the goo monster. Princess Snapdragon tried to pull the monster out, but it stuck like the stickiest glue. He 怎么进去的好厉害哦 Oh, that's not your home," said Princess Snapdragon. "You don't fit in there." The goo monster had grown so big that it popped out of the bottle and dived into the mole habitat. Oh, now said the goo monster, "That's not your home," said Princess Honeysuckle. "That's the mole's home. The mole and the goo monster couldn't all fit in there. The mole felt jammed. The mole felt cramped. The mole bit the." Bit the goo monster. It yelped. It leaped out of the mole habitat. So it was bit. It 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 But I need that bucket for my project," said Princess Orchid. "And a bucket isn't a very good place to live," said Princess Snapdragon. "Oh, besides," said Princess Honeysuckle, "you don't fit." "Fit," said the Goo Monster. "Fit in." "Huh? Fit in?" Nose holes and elephants," said the princess in blankets. "I have got an idea. I know what you're thinking," said the princess in black. "Let's go." 我有一个绕口令，吃葡萄不吐葡萄皮。<laughs> 很好啊，<laughs> 为什么突然想要绕口令？好，你接着看。The princess in blankets and the princess in black. Picked up the bucket. They ran towards the train station. Three princesses looked at one another, and then three princesses followed. 
Chapter Six， 他们都上了火车，应该好挤哦。The train was crowded. Princess Honeysuckle was squished. Princess Snapdragon was squashed. Someone stepped on Princess Orchid's toes. Hold now, said the Goo Monster. No. Not yet, said the Princess in Black. There's not enough room here. Oh, it's my monster! Said someone on the train. The people on one side jammed together. The the people on the other side crammed together. Suddenly, there was plenty of room for the girls and the monster. Hold now! Said the goo monster. <laughs> 突然变得好宽敞，大家都不敢靠近哎，对不对？ No," said the people on the train. 大家都不想要他在这里。The Goo Monster sighed. <sighs> At last, the train arrived at Princess Magnolia's kingdom. The two heroes balanced the buckets on their shoulders. They carried the carry the monster off the train. The people on the train sighed. Then the train sighed. It shuddered about. It rolled away. The goo monster pointed a blobby hand at Princess Magnolia's castle. Hong, it said. No, not there," said the princess in black. "Definitely not there." The goo monster started to climb out of the bucket. "Stay," said the princess in blanket. "You're almost to your new home. We'd better hurry," said the princess in black. But the bucket was heavy. It was so heavy that the heroes couldn't carry it and run. Oh, I can help," said Princess Snapdragon. She squished it, it with the heroes, but there wasn't room for three girls to hold one bucket. Oh, I wish we had Princess Orchid's bucket boosting teeter totter," said Princess Snapdragon. Or some way to make carrying this bucket easier," said Princess Orchid. "If only we could all share the weight," said Princess Honeysuckle. "I have an idea," said Princess Orchid. "Princess in blankets, do you have extra blankets?" "Great idea," said Princess Honeysuckle. "If we put the blanket under the bucket, and we each hold." On to the the edge of the blankets," said Princess Orchid. "Wow, 这样会比较容易，可以，可以这样扛住这个怪兽，对不对？可以把它送到那个怪兽的怪兽世界去。We can distribute the weight evenly," said the princess in blankets. Some says that princesses don't run, but this five did. They ran very fast and carried a monster between them. Chapter Seven. The Goo Monster was hungry. All it had eaten today was one small science fair poster. One small science fair poster was not enough food for a growing Goo Monster. Every time it tried to get, tried to eat something, a princess shouted at it. And every time it tried to find a home, a princess shouted at it. Princesses were very confusing and shouty. Now five princesses were giving it a ride in the bucket. The goo monster enjoyed bucket rides, but it was still hungry. The goo monster leaned over. It tried to nibble on some princess head fur. Behave, beast! said the princess in black. The goo monster did not know how to behave. It didn't know how to eat fur, so it tried again. You may not eat my hair," said the princess in black. The goo monster sighed. It did not fit in with volcanoes. It did not fit in with bottles, molds, or buckets. It especially did not fit in with princesses. Where could a goo monster fit in? Chapter Eight. Back in the goat pasture, a purple monster had come out of the hole, the hole that led to Monster Land. Eat goats," said the purple monster. 
Not today," said the Gold Avenger. The Gold Avenger enjoys saying, "Not today." Also, not on my watch. And back, monster, back to your infernal pit! Shouting battle cries was the best part of being a monster battling hero. Sometimes the battle cries. Scare the monsters away, but mostly the monster just wanted to eat goats. The Gold Avenger would not let monsters eat the goats, so the Purple Monster and the Gold Avenger prepared to wedge battle. Wedging battle was the second best part of the being, of being a hero. Just then, the princess in black came running into the goat pasture with the princess in blankets. Also, three other princesses. Oh, they finally arrived. Came to the monster world. It was a whole princess herd. What? It was a whole princess herd. 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 It was a whole Slid out of the bucket, it squished and squashed over to the hole. It looked down. Fit in, it said. The purple monster nodded. Fit in. Eat monster fur. Eat toenail clippings. Big fun monster land. New hole," said the goo monster, and they both dropped into the hole. They are all going home. Yeah, that's good. Chapter nine: The five princesses plop down on the grass. They all sigh. Oh, what just happened? Asked the gold avenger. We ran," said the princess in black. "All the way from the train station," said the princess in blankets. Oh. Carrying a heavy monster," said Princess Honeysuckle. "In a bucket," said Princess Orchid. "I'm tired," said Princess Snapdragon. "I'm pooped," said Princess Orchid. "That was fun," said Princess Honeysuckle. The princesses laughed. "But I was about to watch battle," said the Gold Avenger. And then my monster laughed. I'm sorry," said the princess in black. "Waging battle is fun. It's my favorite part of being a hero," said the princess in blankets. "Mine too," said the gold avenger. After the battle cries, the hero said, "Behave, beast, and not today, and." Back to your infernal pit. The three heroes laughed. The three princesses sighed. I wish I was a hero," said Princess Honeysuckle. "Me too," said Princess Orchid. "But we, but you are," said the princess in black. "You were so strong with the bucket and brave with the monster, and you helped it find a home." Chapter Ten. You 还记得是谁赢的那个科学展览吗？哦、oh, ，这是谁 ？Back at the science fair, Princess Honeysuckle really, really wanted to win first prize, but she did not. Princess Orchid got first prize. Princess Honeysuckle cheered. Everyone cheered. Princess Magnolia cheered the loudest of all. Are you okay? Asked Princess Honeysuckle. It's not fair. A monster ate your project. I'm happy Princess Orchid won," said Princess Magnolia. And next year I'm going to work harder. Next year I'm going to do something amazing. Princess Honeysuckle smiled. She would like to work harder too. She would like to do something amazing, amazing like making a bucket boosting teeter totter, amazing like battling a monster. She looked at Princess Orchid. Princess Orchid looked at Princess Snapdragon. Princess Snapdragon looked at Princess Honeysuckle. At that moment, 
They were all thinking the exactly exact same thing. 他们在想什么？ Oh, the princess in black was right. They already were heroes. They just needed disguise and secret names. So we all become heroes. They all have new costumes. So cool! Okay, this is the princess in black and the science fair scare. 中间被打断好几次，但没关系。前面几册都讲完了，今天也补完第六册，太好了，开心。你喜欢吗？你要当 princess 咪咪咪吗？好啊。好啊，那你就是 princess 咪咪咪。你要选一种花，你是什么花？杜鹃花、喇叭花、太阳花，还是什么花？郁金香，太阳花，你要当太阳花，我是郁金香、啊，那就叫你 Princess Sunflower 好了，好吗？ Princess Sunflower， 好，谢谢大家。